Out of My Head um, is a song basically a, a bit 80s inspired. You know, for me, it's so much fun to perform that song and, and you can definitely, you know, dance around to it. It's a song about when there's so many opinions going on, you know, it's, you know, all the voices that are going on and, and opinions. So it, it's kind of um, a funny way of saying stop talking. So I kind of thought that I, 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 I was pretty funny. <laughs> Boys is basically a fun dance track. You know, when I when I was making it, I was like, oh, this is definitely something like you would hear in the summer and roll your windows down. We were making it. I was like, wow, like it's kind of going that direction. Um, I wanted to do the song that was basically just kind of fun and lighthearted. And, you know, it's kind of one of those things where um, I think for, for most girls, you know, it, it's kind of fun to have the, the control whenever you're being out with the boys. <laughs> the ladies have to hypnotize them. <laughs> People always ask, you know, what rules do you break? I guess I, I, I maybe break rules, but I don't really, I, I don't really get in trouble too much or anything. It was kind of more of a, a fun idea and, and a fun song to do. It was actually um, the second song I did working with Timbaland and his whole camp, so that was fun. No Time for Tears is one of those songs basically saying, you know, uh, everybody has their own journey and, you know, it's saying, you know, like the million miles that you've gone, you know, and signs like when you want to give something up, you know, just saying that, that you're not and you're going to stay focused and you're going to keep on, you know, you're working on the right track and whatnot. Whenever I heard the track to this song, I was like, I have to, I have to do that song. I have to write to it. I got to do that song. So. Little Miss Obsessive is uh, got this rock pop sound and most everybody's probably been in this situation where, you know, you kind of put your foot in your mouth in a relationship and, and you shouldn't have said it or, you know, sometimes that's it and it's actually over, you know, and the crazy things like, you know, when you could call somebody too many times or like, you know, then you start becoming really obsessive and you're like, I gotta stop this. So it's kind of an idea based upon that and um, my one of my girlfriends was like going through a breakup so I was kind of inspired by that as well. It is a little bit of, you know, a personal experience and, um, you know, it's kind of a song. I, I always like to write songs and do songs that, you know, my friends can relate to as well. You know, I, I love the police, so it kind of has like a little bit of a feel for, a feel of that. And like, I love reggae music, so it kind of has this um, cool beat. You know, for me, it was more of a, a visual concept doing that song. Bittersweet World is the album title of my record. It's a song, you know, about basically, you know, if everybody could just kind of uh, come together and be happy because we got one life to live and, uh, you know, there's no reason for, for the pointing fingers. And I think we, we, you know, we all could definitely say, oh, I've done that before. So it's something instead of, of doing that, maybe helping one another out. <laughs> What I've Become is a song about coming into your own, finding your way and your path. And I think that, um, you know, at, at times people can be really harsh and always have, you know, opinions or always, you know, in your face. And you're like, oh, wait, like, you know, I, I'm kind of coming into my own and like, let me live, let me mess up, let me, you know, I'm supposed to do that. And um, you'll hear on the record there's definitely kind of like, let me be who I am, and, and there's no if, ands, or but, that's exactly what I'm going to do. <laughs> you know, you definitely hear a little bit of that on the record. <laughs> Hot Stuff is a fun, quirky song, which making the record was such a blast and uh, I kind of do like different voices and you know kind of like the girl that's like ah uh, whatever you know so you hear a little bit of that and um, it, it's kind of making fun of you know people whenever you see them out and they have like some catty girl thing that's pretty funny so Murder is about, you know, the, the course, like, don't keep me in the dark because I'll find the light. So it's like no matter, you know, what situation you're, you're going through, it's kind of like you'll always kind of find your way through it and you'll kind of go to the light instead of the dark. Never Dream Alone is the last song on the record and um, Kenna and I just sat there and I was like, oh, I just like am in a chill mode and that's kind of when we started doing that song. So it was spontaneous and um, it's kind of a little bit of a, a romantic song and, and you know a sweet statement to someone special. Mm -hmm.